Uh, hello everyone, this is Pingu for Life here, and today we're going to be looking for the charm stones on Wonder Boy 3, the Dragon's Trap. First thing you want to have to be is the Lion Man for the first charm stone. Going to go all the way up here, we're heading off to the desert. My favourite to have is the Tornado Magic. Going to go over one screen I believe, no two screens sorry. Picking on these guys. Here we go. Stop right here. I just chuck one of them down. You're gonna have to watch out for that, or else it's gonna pop you back up. You're gonna get hurt. No. Wait, I'm stuck. Go up here, and here's the lizard man first. This is the first charm stone. Oh jeez, it's pretty ruthless, so look out. The next charm we are going to go for is the mouse man. Now, I go into this building right here. If you don't have the Tasmanian sword, you'll have to go in here just to change your form. And we are off to get the Mouse Man charm stone now. So from town, you want to go towards the tower. Stick yourself on this, break that, and fall down. And you're all the way left. Now here you're going to have to jump twice. There we go. Fall down. Now we have to go to the end of the screen. You don't want to go right through though. Oh jeez. There we go. And here we are, the unknown for Mouse Man. Now the next charm we are going to do is going to be for the Piranha Man. And you want to take a straight right down here. We're going to go to the beach. This is the first one I actually found. It's a pretty obvious um, spot where the door is. Just looks like there's a secret there. It's all drop straight down there into the, the first screen. You want to come up here and you press up right here and you'll end up in the door. Be careful because you're going to have to run back and time yourself to get up there. Now the next charm stone we are after is going to be Lion Man's actual one. Even though we used him for the Lizard Man, because there's no other way in there unless you just jump, but that's a way I find easier. You want to jump down the well here. Go all the way right to the beach. Keep on keeping on. Now we're going to go over one screen. Once you're here, you want to drop straight down here and you'll see two fish and octopus. You go run right over here. What you're going to do is drop down this first one, go left, turn right a little bit, and if you attack, you're going to break a block. Now you drop down here. And as soon as you go through that door, you're going to be with those two blue enemies, but you're going to have to get out of there quickly, yes, just because they attack you. Once you go through here, you'll be in the unknown. Now the second last one we are going to... Oh. Now next charm stone we're after is going to be the Hawkman. And what we're going to do is go up here, back up this tower, 
Go up a bit more. Oh, okay. I could have flew up here from the outside, but I'll show you walk in there. Now from here, you want to go right. Now, oh, I did not expect them to be right there. Let's do it this way. Now when you get here, you can actually jump straight away and just fly over everything. <laughs> you just got to keep pressing the button, your jump button. And keep flying over. The last screen, hopefully. Oh, that got close. Oh, thought that one was gonna hit. Uh oh, okay, I made it. Oh, geez, it's not the last screen. All right, there's the house. I think we've still got to go two screens over. No, it might just be this one. Oh, sorry. That is another one. There it is. You just fly right over this. And you're in the unknown. Final charm stone, we are going to be the human, or human girl, anyway. Choose you a boy, I thought I'd choose a girl, I don't know why. Anyway, we're going to carry on. This one shows you at the end of the game anyway if you watch the credits, but you just go left, head on over, in this door, and once you go through this one, you will be in the humans unknown. Since I have the Tasmanian sword, you can just jump, press up, and attack, and you can change your character. I actually want to show you where you can, once you have all the charm stones, you can come all, you drop down there, you go left, keep going left, and once you have hit this, okay, I'll miss it, door will be there, press up, and you can buy a sword that's usually there, I shouldn't have brought it to show you guys, but it's the Gallic sword. And that sword will, it gives 250 attack, and that's how you get my magic items. I just went and farmed them a bit. Anyway, thank you for watching the tutorial. I hope that helped you a lot, and I hope to see you in the near future.